Welcome to the wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day, Episode 2. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. And if this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the little bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. Now this is Episode 2, so in the description I've got a link there for you to go to Episode 1 if you missed it. Alright? Now we're going to continue on with my ZY Grand Slam. Okay, this is just a beautiful razor. Real wood scales, metal spacer, hollow ground, and look at this. Fit and finish on this is brilliant. Just really nice. And the razor was only like $7.88. All right, and for our soap tonight, Arco, all right, and this is for me. This is really a nice, wonderful citrusy scent. I do enjoy it. And for my shaving brush, my Omega 10,098, and it is loaded. So let's get going. All right, we'll just load this up, get a nice lather on. All right. Now, guys, I do make Friday specials. And, uh, you know, I normally make them uh, out of questions or suggestions from my viewers and subscribers. So if you have a question or a suggestion for a uh, Friday special that you'd like to see just let me know and uh, I will go ahead and give you a shout out and uh, Let people know who you are where you are Especially if you have videos uploaded uh, You know that would be good, right? You know so you know just I really do enjoy the interaction and I I'm enjoying all the questions that I get, and I like it. I really do. I just enjoy shaving. I enjoy wet shaving the old-fashioned way. So if you think that this looks interesting or intriguing, but have a question about how, how do you do something, just let me know. And... Uh, Hopefully, I can answer it. Oh, yeah, look at that lather. Wow, nice. All right, so now this is the Wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day, Episode 2, which is a pass and a half. So what I'm going to do is I'm going across the grain on my neck. I'm going to go against the grain on my cheeks. Then right through here on my neck, that will be against the grain as well. All right, so let's get going. And notice I'm always stretching with my off hand. And if I'm not stretching, I'll, I'll be contorting my face or both. Hmm. Nice. Great lather.
And on my chin there, that's against the grain as well. Nice. Now we're switching hands. We're going to do this other side. Okay, here we go. Now, let's get this other side. So far, so good. Nice. This is really an excellent shape. I hope you guys are having good shapes as well. to that is a lick dry. Didn't hit the water soap ratio quite right. Nothing a quick refresh can't help, right? <laughs> Okay. There's that. Now. Let me finish up up here. There we go. Nice. Okay.
Yeah. All right, pass two complete. Let's see how we did. Oh yeah. Wow. Oh yeah. Yeah, those cheeks are right where we need them, guys. Now, time for the half pass. All right, now this is just my jawline and my neck. And this is primarily going to be against the grain. There's that. All right. Oh, yeah. Nice. I'm telling you guys, really good. I'm enjoying this. Just light touch. And just enough stretch to get that skin taut. There we go. Another shave in the books, guys. And look at that. Just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. This is really a nice razor. I mean, for the money, you can't beat that. And it is stainless steel. I know there are guys out there that don't think that those are that comfortable. But, you know, that's okay. That is okay as well. I don't mind. Let me know what you guys think. Because I have both. I have stainless and carbon steel. What do you think gives the best shave? Most comfortable shave? Or has it to do more with the stones that the razor was honed on. All right, now that was alum everywhere. And now I'm going with the Thayer's Witch Hazel, and this is extra cool. It is marvelous. This has got, again, a citrusy scent. 
uh, more of a grapefruit, actually, which is nice. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. That is so good. We'll just get that everywhere. That'll be fine. And for our cologne tonight, Florida water. Yep. Nice, fresh, summery kind of scent. Right? You gotta love it. This is summer in a bottle, guys. Very nice. And we're going to top this shave off with the Nivea Poche Balm. Put that moisture back in the skin. And you are done. Yeah. Okay. And again, this has a little uh, kind of citrusy scent as well. All right. Hey, thank you guys so much. I really appreciate you. Click right over here to see episode one. If you missed it, click down here on the video especially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.